All right, folks. Tonight is our Pride Night, so you will see many people with many rainbow-like things going on today. So if you see that, don't be surprised. Also, quick shout-out reminder, we do have Cactus merchandise now. Feel free to check out our store. We got hats, t-shirts, beanies, mugs, all kinds of awesome things so give it a check out order you some get you some and the stuff is awesome kenny on our social media has already been uh showing off one of the hats he ordered and it looks really really good so feel free to give it a check out we are going to get started here any minute I think just giving it that half line makes it better. People are just too confused. That's why I moved this off so the ref could stand in the middle, but the refs keep wandering. And then if you have a wandering ref with the table offset, it's really gonna mess with people. There you go. Yeah, Trevor. Uh, Hello, May. What's up, Daddy JD? I like that shirt, man. I'm tired today, but I'm all right. Our teams are doing a quick photo opportunity to uh, celebrate Pride Month. You might be able to see the uh, flag on the middle court for the LGBTQ flag. So everyone's wearing stickers and flags and all kinds of colors today to be supportive. So we really appreciate everybody coming out and showing love. On. We got more flags going up right now. As 
we are done with team photos, people will be back. Normally we do start right at 7 on the dot. We are just a few minutes late today. I do apologize. Getting the pictures, getting all the people organized does take an extra minute or two. But uh, always worth it. I think the best flag I've seen all day today it might be just kind of off to the side of the into the middle court you might not be able to see it it's the black flag with the rainbows it says everyone is welcome here and that is absolutely true in the dodgeball community everyone is welcome here in the dodgeball community nothing but love it's a great place to be Back up. I mean, you were in it technically. There you go. Now you're in there. Hi, I like that shirt, Fire Nation. That's a. Uh, oh, box lunch, box lunch or whatever. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Very cool. I am a wee bit jealous. So buy all of them. Got it. On the right side of our screen is going to be Bangladesh. All abbreviated on the screen is Bang, just because it's a little easier for me. And then on the far side of the screen is going to be Kazakhstan. We're going to call that K-A-Z today. And let's get the timer up there. Games are underway.
Denny with the kill right up front. Takes out Bryce. Brittany making a call here. Finger behind the ball. Takes the shot. And he plays the ball. Brittany again making a call for her team. Doing a good job on defense, dodging both balls. Shot into the corner, taking out Trevor. They shot the captain. Three players left for Kazakhstan. Bangladesh doing a great job. Only lost one player so far in this game. Even with a quick counter, doesn't connect. Take out yeah, one more there. And he's going to follow the ball. Kazakhstan just down to Mayley. Big throw into Brittany. Brittany blocks. Mayley's looking like she's got a lot of power in her arm today. Those are some strong throws. Brings us to 1 0. Bangladesh on five balls. Oh. 
Ethan taking the quick counter, getting the kill on Bryce. Takes another throw on the Trevor. Back to back kills by Ethan. And a catch. Back to back kills and a catch by Ethan. One lady in the left corner, one male on the right. Three balls thrown, he dodges two and blocks one. Great job. Ooh, a big pump fake, doesn't throw, talks to his teammate first. Kevin with the catch. Kevin with the block. Or 2 0 in favor of Bangladesh. What a game. Ethan, a double kill turned in then to a catch. Three kills in about five seconds. Kevin doing a great job getting a catch for his team there as well. Bangladesh team to show up today. Bangladesh with a really smart trade in that opening play. They traded out the captain, Trevor, and the uh, Last lady standing did get thrown out there. Brings us to 3 0. Another quick pitch by Kenny. They got back again. They got back in that exchange. Probably the first time Kazakhstan won the exchange at the opening round. 
Trevor taking a shot on the corner, didn't connect. Corners for Kenny in that exchange. Great job by Bangladesh. Heather with a great throw and to break any angles of the line. Brittany making a quick call for her team. Ethan takes the throw. Four balls on top of there. Great power, no connection. Off the ball, nothing connection. He's going to any pressure to get a rebound. Taking out J.E. Kazakhstan turning. Eight minutes left in the first half. It is Danny's only second season ever at Gaza. So she's roughly three months into playing this game. And she's been last lady standing or last player standing multiple times on the court already today, showing she's got spunk and fight. It's awesome to see. Just a 4-0. Very decisive game today. Quick release again, taking out JD for zero cost. Oh, well, they went through too many balls. And they need back to the ball as well. Bangladesh is running corner. Back is known to uh, strong entry the counter. Like that, it's 4 4. Kazakhstan's trying to make its gun for its first win. <laughs> you do get Trevor there. Kazakhstan's needed him a lot.
line out from Kazakhstan in the final 1v1. That was our first chance, and you get a line out. How painful. That was Kazakhstan's chance to win a point, and they got lined out. That feels so bad. But you can see the other player also asking where the line is for the middle because the lines in the middle are kind of blue, and it's hard to tell. And he did not connect on the opening run. The first time he's missed all day in his opening run. Evan making a call. Taking the throw himself. Day today in the corner. Not been good. It's been a huge problem for Kazakhstan. Head rough just confirmed. 90 seconds left on the clock. Did connect to the player's head on the left corner. They just got a camera. Gave the head. Can't believe that he was okay. No issues. We are just playing seven inch foam today, so no major issues. Take out Danny, just mailing left for Kazakhstan. Mailing versus five. Mailing with a quick throw, taking out two. She's down to only three left. That yeah, doesn't quite get there, though. Brings us to six zero. going into no block. So I'm going to reset the timer now, but we are in no blocking. You block a ball, you are out. Yeah. <laughs> 
That does bring us to 7-0 at half. Teams are going to switch sides, take about 60 seconds, and then we are going to go again. In the meantime, quick shout out to our sponsors, EagleAZ.com and Your Best Mortgage. If you're interested in getting some Cactus merchandise in the comments there, please feel free to check it out. So we are switching sides here at halftime. And we'll be going again very soon. Yeah. So first half of 20 minutes, second half. How's life insurance been going? It seems like for a while you were posting every day about how awesome you are. Like, nailing you know, Yeah, I've been so busy. I just missed lately, to be honest with you. But yeah, good. Just super busy. Yeah. Like, I have to, I've been getting better about how to get time off in my calendar to ensure I get Yeah. It was bad for a while, and it was like 7 a.m. and can't like. Oh, that's long. Yeah. So, yeah, it's good. Well, it's nice that you've come over to say hi to me. She, her ADHD, you know, she's like, well, sometimes I question. You know, it's all the same page. I mean, I've chosen dodgeball over a lot of things in my life. What's up, Uncle? What are you missing? Uh, I wasn't over here. Sorry. How's your job doing? Good, good. Um, our team as a whole took second over like all the other teams and we're almost entirely new people other than like two people that have been there a while and one of the people that's been there a while was gone all last week sick. So we have one experienced person on our team that's been at the company a while, a bunch of new people. And we took second place of like 12 teams. Can I meet the company? Yeah. yeah. So it's like Florida property sales, so it's very complicated. But uh, when it's working out, it's uh, really fun. So. Did, are you like salaried through sales or commissioned? Um, I am salaried with a two bonus program. Oh, nice. So, like, I get an yeah. annual bonus that's usually pretty big because we really, really perform well in our department. Yeah. And then there's a Christmas bonus, like the first paycheck of every year that's just an extra paycheck. Nice. So, like, December is to just have an extra paycheck, cool. which is pretty nice. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Anything else you want like? You know, travel plans? We were just talking about it. My birthday's coming up. We were like, where do we want to go? We have nothing planned yet. We're trying to figure that out. Okay. But my brother moved out here in March. Him and his girlfriend. So we've been yeah, like, yes. hanging out with them and stuff. Okay. I was saying you were you're talking about uh, your parents moved down here too, right? Yeah, so my mom and yeah. my other brother and sister. I, this dude needs to go. Gonna get it's fine. Now it's going to come. What about you? Anything you need? Um, after coming back from my sister's wedding in Tennessee, that's kind of the end of my like, travel plans, probably till. I don't know you have any siblings. Uh, I have a uh, blended family. Huh? I have a blended family, sure. so I have like three sets of kids. Yeah. 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 That's not a surprise. Um, yeah, so I have a very blended family, but I grew up with all my siblings from like the age of six and up. So there. Yeah. But yeah, I had a week off at the end of May, and then another like four and a half days off. 
the first week of June. So I was like, I need to not take some time off for a while. Because I was fighting for first place for sales, and then taking that fight off killed me. All right, and just like that, they are in the game. United States versus Austria, 18 here. <laughs> in case anyone was wondering what happened to Snell, Trevor McCord did make a successful catch, but the play was over the middle line, no valid throw, so no catch. Danny with a catch! My fair share of squabbles in a relationship, but <laughs> not usually enough to get punched there. No. No, <laughs> well, I'm usually the nice guy in a relationship. I have to do like healthy boundary setting and all of that. Sometimes we'll get behind the table. <laughs> Zach shaking his head. That was a terrible throw straight to the ground.
a nice little toast knife. Bangkok only down one player now. Kevin with a dropped catch from Danny. See him being inside. Just Kenny left right now. He's got five balls. Let's see if he catches JD sleeping with those ankles. There it is. Blocking his knee. Kenny, he's got the advantage here a little bit, actually. Kenny's got a lot of experience in this game. Probably about four times as much as these two. Let's see if he can do it. One on one. And he's going to outgun him. And he's trying. It's funny, both these players prefer to catch out, but they're going to try and gun this out. And he's pushing. Beats out another catch. Last ball. Last ball. Get it. 8 2 score. Great job by Kenny. I do apologize, I did forget to start the timer. We're just under nine minutes. Ago. Puts it on player just like that. Danny is last player standing. Man, that's an uphill battle. She's got everybody on the other side. Player was a little confused. He thought he caught the ball, but he caught the ball in the ground, aka it's a trap. So that player is out. A little flush there. There is a little confusing of a rule, but she did get him out. One down. Got to do a few more. And there it is. They do throw her out. Score now nine deuce. We can instant replay that real quick for you. Opening rush throw gets two out. Let's see if that'll work here. Instant replay here. There's the opening rush. Pitch back to Kenny. One, two. Beautifully done by Kenny. You don't do sports like dodgeball. Do you just live in the gym more and more? Um, I don't play sports. I played baseball and tennis. Those um, are very high-paced sports. 
that I am not as adorable as anyone under the age of like six ever. I'm adorable, but not that adorable. Players for rule clarification, although they lost the player, they had ball control and didn't throw a ball quick enough. So they did lose all ball. And that does cost them the game, bringing us to 10-0. It is two 20 minute pass. So we're about five minutes left in the uh, second 20 minutes. Um, but yeah. Two 20 minute halves, and it's just number of points played. So and today we're seeing a lot of points because one team is dominating. Yeah. And very common score might be a lot less of like four four at the end of time. So, This season is random draw. Oh, okay. How do they ensure that it's fairly able So, with Cactus, what they do is they have like a tiering system that is overseen by a committee. And each team gets so many players from each team. And that's what's random. Correct. Okay. Got it. And then, like, uh, well, Nooch right here is on the committee. Uh, Tony right here is on the committee, myself. Uh, Ruben is no Ruben. Uh, Ruben and Grace. So there's there's probably about six six people on the committee, I think. Um, different people have different tasks here. Like, obviously, I'm on the street. Uh, Tony is very considered the head player. So different people have different jobs. But we all do weigh in on different things. So it's, you know, not always one thing. Hey, well, hey, Matt, while you're here, you want to see something really cool in the middle of a game? Mm, bam, the sponsor, and it's just for you, baby. Yeah? Right there. That's you. Every time before a game, halftime, and after. Your name all over, baby. Sing it. I got I dodged it. My hands are rusty right now. Do you see where my hands are? They're rusty. I'm going to get shit for me. I'm a broke bitch. Hell, I still have my 07 Prius with like 200 plus thousand miles on it. You want to sue me? You want my Prius? It's not even worth it. Worth it. No mercy from Bangkok today. Yeah. 
So, for example, on the bar court, the score is only four to five. Yeah, that's something I usually do. Thank you. At least someone's trying to protect me. I mean, yeah, but I haven't seen all of it. Oh, that's <laughs> bad. I do remember that. Your wife is. Your wife is. I, don't, I was going to say addicted to you, but that's not the right word. But you're upset. upset. <laughs> yeah. She is a devoted wife. You don't have to worry about anything. Oh, no. All right, we are now at time. There's 11 dudes. Need to update the head referee here in a little bit. Oh. Folks, up next on the rosters, we have Austria, captained by Kendall Smith with Malia, Matt, JD, Damian, Kay, and Justin, versus, I believe it's the USA, captained by Don, also with big man Allen himself, Derek, Jesse, Ryan Marcus, Lisbeth, and Aaron Jackson. I myself will be playing in this second half, so it will just be. Uh, no comment, but you should have sound the whole time, so please enjoy the games.
nine was our final score, folks. Nice, nice, nice. Nothing better than a six nine on the scoreboard at the end of the day for some inappropriate jokes. Thank you again to our sponsors here, EvoAZ.com and Your Best Mortgage. If you're thinking about buying a home here in Arizona, please give them a call. Thank you all for checking out Cactus Dodgeball tonight. Thank <laughs> you.